Hey skiers, it's Bob with SkiEssentials.com. Welcome to our 2023 ski test. We've got a Nordica Enforcer 110 free for you today. Uh, this ski gets a little bit of a graphics update, but remains the same structurally to what we've seen in the past, uh, which is an awesome wider free ride ski that still has a pretty burly construction to it that makes it uh, just a little bit different than everything else out there on the market. Uh, built with the wood core, we get two sheets of metal, a uh, really great strong construction from Nordica here. Uh, they use thinner metal in their, in their uh, enforcer constructions and that leads to a more nimble nature of the ski uh, while keeping the dampness you know, top notch, very minimal vibrations on this one and just a really just a pleasure to ski in a variety of snow conditions, obviously at 110 millimeter underfoot and with the uh, extended tip and tail rocker, we're gonna see better performance in soft snow, but one of the things that's always stood out to me about this ski is its ability to perform uh, on firmer snow and in groomers. So it's, you know, a really well-rounded 110. Great, great choice for that advanced expert skier who wants something on the uh, more, more stiff and demanding end of the spectrum for a wide ski, but still not, not overbearing. Uh, we do get some weight with this one here. This is the 185 and we're seeing a weight of 2,323 grams on the scale. So there is some heft behind it. Uh, just there's a lot of mass and surface area as well. So, but it does translate well to on, to on snow performance. It never feels that heavy. Where we see a lot of the, a lot of the uh, performance upgrades here is in the rocker extending or the shape extending beyond the rocker. One of the nice things they did graphically for us is give us a cheat sheet on the base. So the start of the blue up top here is where the rocker starts and then the blue corner is where the uh, side cut ends. So that's the end of the taper. And then we see that on the tip as well. So rocker starts here, side cut ends there. So the side cut extends beyond the rocker. That gives the ski a nice, nice long uh, effective edge and leads to its smoothness. So it's a nice little Graphic reminder from Nordica that they do something a little bit different than other ski companies and they do it on purpose uh, and that reason really works. Uh, we do see that nice positive camber underfoot. You know, in this 185, we're talking about an 18.5 meter turn radius. So that's kind of short for a 110. And the fact that you're able to access that side cut really makes this thing carve well and it wants to turn. Uh, but that doesn't mean that it's going to be hooky and powder when we get to that tail rocker profile It'll become pretty clear, but uh, you know This is a good way to see where the where the taper starts the widest point and then the rocker extends beyond that so Nice rocker on this one pretty pretty good splay uh, That's going to make the ski surf up and over on any type of fresh or deep snow and Then we'll see that in the tail as well. So even though we got two sheets of metal uh, and a pretty burly build, we still have that nice gradual rocker and some pretty moderate splay in the tail, allowing it to be pretty surfy. So it's kind of a counterbalance aspect that Nordica is pulling off here. And then we see that nice rounded shape uh, as we do in all the other Enforcer Series skis. And that really helps keep that tail nice and smooth. You know, it holds tight up to the end of the edge on uh, anything firmer. And then in anything soft, when you get into the tapered and rounded aspect, it has a more playful feel to it. So a great overall choice uh, and awesome feel for that advanced and expert skier who's, you know, ideally spending most of their time in fresh and soft snow. Uh, but yeah, that's it. That's the Nordica Enforcer 110 free. Awesome free ride ski, great in the powder, surprisingly agile and nimble. Uh, especially given the weight. So check this thing out at skiessentials.com and we'll see you out there on the hill. Bye.